I always said this vegetable chopper set in exchange for this video, so let's go ahead and see what is inside, and we're also going to test it out. Right, we have the brush, we have the instructions, we have the tray, so this holds everything that you slice or chop. We have the tray, and this is the top part of the chopper, so that just fits over top. You open it up, place whatever you want to chop in here, and then we also have another set of blades. So this one is smaller. I'm gonna go ahead and take this off so you can see what I'm talking about. So these are sharp, of course, so definitely be careful when handling these. You can see we have a locking button right here, so you make sure you lock these in place, but you can see the size difference. These are gonna make smaller dices, and then these are the larger ones. And you put your food in there. What happens is you press this down, and it presses it into the bottom tray here and keeps all of your food nice and neat, ready to dump into a stew or whatever you wanna use these for. So to trade, change these out, like I said, we just unlock over here, lift this out. We have these two pieces here, they go towards the back and then lock and this will not lift out. So really easy to do that. I'm gonna go ahead and put the larger one back in though and then lock into place, really quick and easy. All right, so let's go ahead and take this to the kitchen and try it out now. So I decided to use something um, like cucumbers for this first demonstration. So we have a couple of those placed on here. We just press down and they pop right out the bottom. We have the nice cubed cu cucumbers for a salad or something like that. I think it'll be a lot easier to eat in your salad when they're nicely cubed like that. So let's do this a second time. So easy to go ahead and whip up a bunch of things like this for a salad, for holidays, or just for everyday use. And they're the perfect size, like I said, for a salad. And of course you could dice these even smaller for other things. So perfect for me, I'll just add some salt, pepper, and vinegar and have a delicious snack.